Rodney wasn't that big when I first went there, and there's even less of it today, and there's far less of it than when it was in its prime. Rodney was a major town on the Mississippi River. It's about halfway between Vicksburg and Natchez, but the river moved away from it around the end of the Civil War, and ever since then, Rodney has been drying up, literally and figuratively. There's still a few folks there, much fewer after the two floods on the Mississippi River back in the teens. The floods did even more damage to an already mostly deserted town. The two big attractions still standing at Rodney are the old Baptist Church building and the Presbyterian Church building. The Baptist building was built back in the mid-century 1800s and made it into the movies and the James Brown story got on up. It has since succumbed to more floods. Hadn't seen it lately, but it was in pretty sad shape the last time I was there. The other big attraction, the Rodney Presbyterian Church, was built in 1833 and survived the shelling of Rodney from a Union gunboat in the Civil War. People still wander their way there to see the church and get a photo of the cannonball in the front wall. Rodney's in an interesting area of the state. It's not all that far from the mystical ruins of Windsor. Mystical if you let your mind carry you away from the practicality of today, because a house like Windsor wouldn't be practical at all. And the old place is so isolated, it's easy to distance yourself from today for a while, while you're there. There are places with spooky names like the bridge over Widow's Creek, hidden in the backwoods nearby. I'm not even sure if the roads are maintained enough to get to Widow's Creek anymore. These are places I'd run away to early in the morning under the guise of work and stay late in the afternoon and catch a deep wood sunset somewhere, then follow the evening mist home. So yes, I've been to Rodney, and I travel back to it many times in my mind when I need to just get away, but can't get away anymore. Not as often as I'd like to anyway. <laughs>